Hi, I'm Daniel and today I'm going to show you the use case of uh, my new SketchUp extension, MetalFab. This is live recording, so mm, there will be some, probably some mistakes and uh, things that we need to change during the process, but it's even better so we can Mm, see uh, how you can do this with uh, the extensions. Okay, so uh, we have a mm, shape of the construction that we would like to uh, design, draw. Uh, those are those are edges. So because extension allows us to use the profiles from the edges or uh, draw profiles uh, like a draw tool. So let's uh, let's start, for example, to, to draw this this object. So we need to first select select those. Yeah. Uh, let's select all the bottom ones. Those are mm, those are separate uh, oh, separate lines edges that we would like to uh, but we would like to draw the the the, the uh, I would like to select one yeah. uh, but we would like to draw the profile on those edges but for example for the for all all those edges we would like to draw one profile not every profile on on one edge because those are separate edges so there's a setting if we if we use the match collinear, collinear edges it will draw um, one profile if the edges are uh, lie on the one line so we select edges like we can see use the draw from edges button let's uh, select the profile that we would like to draw on those edges for example, rectangular one 50 by 50 by 4 millimeters. Mm. Let's draw. Let's see what happened. Yeah. So we get some some profiles. Draw it. Yeah. We can see that how it looks like on the connections. Yeah. So for example let's let's check the length of uh, the, those uh, the list of those uh, profiles so when i select the bomb i will get exact length of and the mentioned exact list of those profiles and there is information that some of the profiles are longer than the set bar length yeah let let let, let we see uh, let us see. So, if I open the settings, the bar length is uh, 12,000 millimeters. I operate in millimeters, so in this video uh, it will be in millimeters, but in the end we can change the units uh, as, as, as we would like to, because uh, it's uh, it's easy to, to, to switch to another uh, units like like uh, in every project of in the SketchUp. So few of them are longer than twelve thousand millimeters. So let's uh, let's make them shorter. Uh, or maybe first let's. Uh, Let's connect them. Yeah, so we would like to have a meter cut between those two, those two uh, objects. 
So to do that, there's a function meter joint, uh, but it's a good practice to make those elements not touch each other be, uh, before we create the miter cut. So I draw already the profiles. Uh, so uh, I can now I can uh, change the length uh, using this offset length, but uh, I could do that uh, when I when I draw the profiles I could use the length offset uh, parameter. So the result would be result uh, would be the same. Uh, so I would like to make the meter joint between those two uh, profiles. To do that, I need to select the meter joint function, select one pipe and second one, and now there's a, a meter joint between two of them. Uh, I am showing you right now the version of the extension 1.4, but in the future there will be option that uh, creates meter joints for more than two profiles at once yeah but today it is it is as it is uh, for the meter uh, joint but later I will show you the how it it will work uh, based on the other function like uh, profile cut so using profile cut uh, already works uh, for uh, for more than uh, one, uh, or in this case, or more than two uh, profiles. Okay, so I create a mm, meter joint between between those profiles, but let 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 us check the maximum length, and it's the same. Few of them are longer than twelve twelve thousand millimeters, so let's uh, make them shorter. And uh, I can make them shorter exact uh, the dimension I need. So, for example, for example, let's make the sh let's shorten those pipes uh, exactly two thousand. Oh, let's let's make it like that. So I set the offset dimension and press on those pipes. In the future this function probably will also have uh, the function to change the length uh, for the um, profiles, not only for one profile but uh, for a bunch of profiles, but today uh, we need to make it one by one. So then I need to redraw the profiles in this in this place and also make the the meter cut yeah so i uh select them uh in this case i will uh i will do um, i will do this uh using the offset minus 200 millimeters and also i will use the extrude and cut op option so for every of those four pipes, there will be also extrude and cut on every end. So when I press OK, we have now four profiles created here, oh. and also already already cut it. Yeah. So in future, this. Uh, this kind of work will also be added to the meter cut, but at, at the moment uh, we can do that only uh, with the mm, with the uh, pipe profile cut. So let's uh, let's make it uh, at the end. Uh, we can also uh, draw every every profile uh, by hand. Let's say. So I draw it, I can also uh, make the meter cut between those two, uh, the same at the, at the end. There are many, many ways of work 
to, to change the workflow. So it's um, it depends on, on you on on your work fo workflow. Also, as we work uh, uh, make it uh, at the moment, uh, sometimes you you create some kind of uh, construction, draw the shape, and you need to edit. So this tool allows you to uh, make changes during the uh, during the pro project uh, so it's um, it's much easier to uh, to make to make a final design as you need so uh, we need to also make connection between those two but let's uh, do this uh, uh, maybe like this so let's make it shorter uh, this is a simple quick setup for the offset length so I can use the half of the size of the mm, profile uh, okay so I make it shorter now I, I make uh, use the profile cut extrude and profile cut and then I uh, make the profile cut also uh, in this mm, for this profile something here but please please check how I can also um, how I can do that uh, a little bit different in a little bit different way yeah so let's uh, make it shorter and now uh, I can I can select both both of them and uh, uh, use the extrude uh, function but in this case in this case um, we are not um, deciding the order of the process so let's make it uh, by hand let's uh, make the profile cut here profile cut here so now I I make the profile cut exactly as I needed uh, let's let's make those profiles I could I could select all of them but I wanted to show you one one thing yeah because like before when I select all of them and uh, create draw the profiles from edges with the uh, function uh, extrude and profile cut there is no control which in which order mm, those profile cuts, uh, cuts are going to be made so uh, it's important to to make it in let's say control way so i select all all edges all vertical edges only and i could i can now draw those uh, profiles with the profile cut so uh, after a few seconds because I, I select a uh, uh, few of them mm, maybe too many of them and also it depends like a, uh, uh, se like, a, like there's an information the process time depends on the uh, profiles amount as well of the your PC as well of the setting of the segmentation because we have a parameter like segmentation here so it means how exact the profile cut is going to be for every pipe so now we can see that every object is a separate object and it was profile cut exact for for the for the shape we need so every of this profile is is uh, cut it uh, exact for the shape and place that he belongs to so in next step mm, let's change this segmentation for 45 let's check it change it to the uh, 12 to get a uh, quicker quicker process let's 
select those. Mm. This extension is going to be developed in near future, so uh, you can expect many updates. There's a built-in uh, auto update function, so every time you open the extension, if there is a new version, you will you will get the um, information. So I select those uh, edges. Uh, do it again. So after a few seconds, uh, we can see that the time was uh, uh, shorter. And now all all of the uh, of those uh, profiles are uh, cutted to exact uh, uh, shape we need. So the whole construction is is now uh, uh, made. Yeah? So now we have the uh, geometry. But what is very interesting and useful. Now we can open the bomb and see every object in on the list. Yeah, so every element has its own uh, uh, mm, name. There is also a function uh, that will help you to create some drawings. Uh, I I just select few of the profiles, and when I press this button i will get i will get the uh, text texts on the screen so i can very easily and and quickly create uh, the the view um, of the of the element so we can see the exact name of the uh, of the part and uh, this is the ex the same this is the same name uh, that we can see on the list uh, so p hash 13 uh, has length 1020 millimeters uh, like you can see here mm. in the future there will be also option to change the information uh, uh, here also there will be function to select object on the list and uh, see in the model which one is it at the moment uh, we can in the settings we can change the prefix of this part so the p we can change to 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 to, to different uh, um, to different one or also we can change the numbering so now we start from from 1 uh, to uh, 76 but if we change it to for example 100 we close it let's close it uh, we can uh, very quickly also delete those information so i changed the numberings uh, uh, index and when i copy all of this and make the second one and press the bomb oh. now we can see or oh, maybe maybe uh, in different way I will show you but oh maybe in that way So this is this is object uh, mm, that we draw uh, uh, at the f first moment, and uh, after copy the number of the object uh, uh, numbering of the object started from uh, one one hundred. Yeah. So 
we have all the list of the uh, parts uh, with the also if we use different profiles there will be list for for different uh, different ones and then you get the nesting cut optimization so you can cut every bar uh, 12,000 millimeters bar mm, to get Mm, to get uh, exact uh, mm, exact parts um, and at the end you can see the summary so to create that kind of construction you need uh, you need uh, uh, 23 pieces of the uh, of uh, 12,000 millimeters bars um, so this extension is going to um, develop in future. This is the current state, uh, the version of the extension which I show you is uh, 1.4. So ex expect that uh, every next version will, uh, will have more function and option. Bye.